Okay. Wow, your neck has seen better days. Oh, we got a special book. Another one, guys. What's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Seven Days to Die Modded series. Today, we are back on Undead Legacy, uh, the beautiful UI mod. Um, <laughs> I've been doing some work off camera, and uh, what are we going to be doing today? Well, I'm going to show you what I've been doing off camera. I'm going to explain to you my thought process on what I want to do next, and then we're going to have to get some water, and we have to get a forge. Um, I went ahead and made a chest, and I'm not seeing any water, like, at all. Um, we have these empty plastic bottles and we can fill these up with water. Uh, but is it going to be like, they're plastic bottles. So how do we boil them? Can we not boil them? I'm not really sure. I'm going to have to find that out, but I do have some jars, um, some glass bottles, but the problem is I can't make some things for the forge. I can't make a campfire in the forge or I'm sorry, campfire. <laughs> I can't make a cooking pot in the forge because my blacksmithing is not high enough. So what we're going to do is we're going to go weapon smithing. Uh, can I just buy this with W? Yes, I can. And we're going to go weaponsmithing, toolsmithing, miscellaneous crafting, and then we're going to look up blacksmith. All right, how many points for that? Five points? Beautiful. We got just enough. Okay, so with blacksmith, we can now make the cooking... We can now make the, um... Can we go back? Now with blacksmith one, we can make the anvil, the cooking grill, the cooking pot, nails, a masonry trowel. Oh, interesting. And empty... Oh, we can make empty cans. That's That's cool. You can't make empty cans of vanilla, can you? I don't know. Maybe you can. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. All these mods and so many... This game's a pretty dense game and with all the mods, I get confused on what I can make and what I can't. Anyway, we need to get a forge up. We need to get some... We need to get some water going. We're going to explore this town. It's not the best town in the world, um, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, I actually looked at this map... Uh, by the way, my my uh, now that now that this is going to be a proper Let's Play series, maybe I should talk about that. This is going to be a proper Let's Play series. You guys, oh boy, you guys let me know in the comments. I asked you to let me know, and you sure did. We're at like 225 uh, comments. Uh, we're over 500 likes. Um, you guys really want to see more of this mod. So I'm going to show you more of this mod. Now, here's the problem. Um, <laughs> 3.0 is coming out relatively soon, Okay. I might have four Seven Days to Die series going again because I want to keep this going and I'm definitely going to be doing Ravenhurst 3.0. And then we also have Vanilla and War of the Walkers. So we might have four uh, worlds going again. It's not really that big of a deal. I can do it. Um, I prefer to have three, but four is not a problem. Okay? So we will probably have four going, uh, you know, relatively soon. So just keep that in mind. All right. So let's take a look at the chest. I made a chest off camera. And it wasn't as easy as you'd think, right? First of all, they have the secure wooden chest is separate. You need glue for that, which is interesting. Um, you also need screws. So, but we don't really need that uh, because it's not really any better than the regular chest. It's, it's more for multiplayer, right? And um, the cool thing is, like, that I didn't, I didn't really fully appreciate in this mod is all the info you get down here. Secure chest, storage, 7x7, 49 slots, crafted in the workbench. Oh my god, we finally have a mod that's going to tell you where you have to craft stuff. <laughs> we had vanilla... Uh, War of the Walkers, Ravenhurst, um, some other ones, like a ton of ton of mods out there, and this one's telling you exactly where you got to craft it for every single item, crafted in the workbench, um, crafted in the backpack inventory. I mean, a lot of these mods do tell you where you need to craft this stuff, but it's not all of it, all right? And this is so just organized. I love it, okay? So this is a regular chest. I had to make some wooden hinges, and I had to use resin, all right? So I went ahead and made a chest. I'm just showing you the complexity of the crafting system now. Um, some people like the complexity of the crafting system. Some people don't. Some people just see it as extra stuff to loot and not really adding much to it. Yeah, you know, it's 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 neat, but it doesn't really add that much. I mean, so you have to make some wooden hinges, and I have to turn some wood into planks. Does that add, does that really add a lot in the grand scheme of gameplay? No, not at all. All right, resin. You get resin from trees. You're getting wood anyway. Doesn't really add a lot, but in the immersion piece of the game that some people really enjoy this adds a lot having to um you know use wooden planks instead of wood having to make wooden hinges having to use resin um it makes sense resin would stick things together hinges so you can f you know open and close lids and using wood planks instead of just logs you get from a tree all adds immersion so i understand why people don't like it i understand why people do like it do i like it i think it's cool i'm kind of like whatever about it like um, the only thing I don't like about it is it makes me use up a lot more inventory slots here because I have to have resin with me, wood planks, I need to keep sticks, maybe some rope, I don't even know what I would use rope for. Yeah, I have to keep rope with me, so I have to keep a lot of things with me that I wouldn't normally uh, do, but that's okay. I'm okay with that. 
Okay, so that brings you guys up to speed. I went ahead and made another torch. Let me show you what it, what we need to make torches. <sighs> there we go. Torch is actually easier in this mod, which I appreciate. I don't think, uh, I don't like the way you have to, well, actually, do you use animal fat in regular torches? I'm not really sure, but torches are easier in this mod, okay? Which is great. Oh, I didn't see the storage box. Oh, that's actually bigger. Can I, can't make that. Backpack, wood. Um, I can't make it because I the nails, that's right. You need nails for that. Okay. Uh, another thing you guys told me in the comments is that every piece in this game has tells you exactly what it's for. Like, uh, like okay, I get a chisel. I'm like, oh, a chisel? What, what's that? Maybe I, maybe I want to break that up. No, it's used in the engineering table. Don't break it up. Okay? I love that. That's great. Um, there were some other things I was thinking about breaking up that I didn't because of that. Uh, yeah, old science magazine. Um, you know, trade... Uh, trade item so don't the, the, the game's basically telling you uh why don't you sell that you're probably gonna make some money out of it. why don't you sell that okay so that's pretty cool i do like that now one thing i'm a little confused about is this old calculator it says junk materials multiple um i wonder if i could somehow use it oh wait it looks like it's damaged but it has an examine thing on it now i didn't examine it because i wanted to do this on camera so let's see what this does oh after closer examination, the following components can be salvaged by destroying the item. Scrap plastic 3, scrap iron, scrap copper. Copper, huh? Um, scrap wires, lithium battery cells, transistors, and capacitors. Okay. All right. So look at that. We got a... Oh, my God. Look at all the stuff we got. Wait. Did I get an advanced generator bank? Oh, that's in the crafting table. I was like, wait, what? No, we're looking over here. All right. So... <laughs> Okay, so we got some wires, we got some lithium batteries, some... Okay, that is cool. That is freaking cool. And look at this, we're gonna need these for generators. Um, fusion generator? A fusion freaking generator. A filament... Fa oh my god, I'm so glad we're doing a Let's Play on this. I'm really glad you guys are into this because I really wanted to do a Let's Play on this. And I was hoping you guys would agree. Alright, enough chit-chat. We're 28 uh, water. We need to get out here and get some work done. Um, we're, I, I know where the water is, but I won't be able to boil it. Um, so what we're looking for now is clay, stone, leather. Um, I think leather will probably be the hardest thing to get. So I think we'll look for leather first. If we see any animals, we will kill them for their uh, hide that we can turn into leather. But what I really want to find is... I'd really like to find a building with black couches. Um, I think these Coronado buildings up here um, have black couches. But maybe we should uh, check out some of the new... Uh, you know what? I really need to make... You know what? I think I'm gonna have to do some empty cans for drink. Well, you know what? If we, you know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? Um, <laughs> if we loot, we might find water. Um, oh, there's a food market over there. Okay. All right, let's go in here. See what we can find in here. Oh boy, we need some more of these uh, wood frames. There we go. Let's uh, favor that. All right, very good. How many of these can we make? One. One, huh? because I don't have the wood planks. Okay. You know what would be nice? If, if I clicked on wood planks and it popped wood planks up over here. Like, okay, I need to make a wood frame. Click, wood frame, wood uh, planks pop up. That would be nice. Because having to, like, go in here for wood planks is um, not very good. Um, okay, so it pops up right next to it anyway, so it's not really that big of a deal. All right, how many of these can we make? We can make 14. Let's go ahead and make 10. All right, wait for those to get done. And then we're going to use these, because we're going to use these wood frames to get over this uh, wall, because I'll be damned if I'm going to break through um, over here. That'll take forever. Okay, so we could probably do this relatively easy here. Yep. Okay, we're in. We're in Lake Flynn. All right, let's go right for the food store. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, dude, 600 hit point door? Okay, never mind, I'll just break this out. No, no, break this out, zombie. Come on, dude. Oh, boy, he's got a lot of, he's got a lot of damage, man. They're doing a lot of damage to doors, huh? I wonder if that's all doors. I wonder if uh, they break through things easier in this mod. What the hell? Walk towards me, idiot. Moron. You big fat moron. Come on. Alright, I'm out of stamina. We need to get that, uh... We need to get that Pummel Pete perk. Uh, maybe I should go knives on this Let's Play. Yeah, maybe I'll go knives. 
Dude. Dude, what's with the hit points, bro? There you go. Now you're dead. Wait, maybe. Okay, I don't know what Big Bertha's doing over there, but... She, she's happy. I think I will leave her alone. No. She's trying to trick me to go in there so she can uh, corner me. I'm not falling for it, Bertha. I'm not falling for it, Big Bertha. You need to give me a spoon. I need a big old spoon for Big Bertha. Come on, now. All right, you. Oh, there's one in your eye. Okay, what do you got? You got a spoon? Oh, she's got a spoon. Very good. An iron shovel. Thank you very much. That is going to come in quite handy. All right, please tell me you got some water for me. Oh, we got some beer and we got some Buzz Coffee. Buzz Coffee doesn't sound like the healthiest. Oh, look at this. A lot of, a lot of sodas. Let's see what these sodas give us exactly. Um, stamina, hydration, wellness. Sodas give you wellness, huh? <laughs> okay, now that's more like it. That's an energy drink. This is uh, Golden Rose. Refreshing and tasty sparkling soda. Yeah, it should never give you wellness. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna hold off though. I'd like to save that for when I'm like running around and stuff. Okay. Alright, you guys. Oh boy, back up. Alright. Come on out here. Oh. Down you go. And you're dead. What about you, buddy? How's your rib cage feeling? How's your sternum doing, man? It doesn't look like it's doing too good there. Alright. Uh, red tea, a keyboard, and shades. I love looting in new mods. I really, really love looting in new mods. This might be one of my favorite looting mods ever. Um, I really like the looting in uh, Ravenhurst because everything's useful. But this is... Man, this is really good. I'm not going to say it's as good or it's better, but... You know, we'll have to see, but, you know, as of right now, I'm, I'm impressed with the uh, loot in this game. And anything that can make the Cracker Book, like last video, anything that make it, that, that can make the Cracker Book good is, <laughs> it's aces in my book. No pun intended, exactly. All right, so let's see what we got here. What was that, anyway? Uh, empty Shamway. All right. Well, we need drink. We haven't got any drink in here except for those sodas. Okay. So let's see if we can make anything with this. Yes, we can. We can do noodle soup. Oh, and you only need one. Okay. Very good. Okay. Okay. I'm probably just going to drink this. I kind of need it, to be honest. There we go. We're up to 40. All right. All right. What do we got in here? Some more soda. Oh, we got a, um, a Mega Cola. Yeah, you guys. The, the, the dude who made this mod loves uh, Fallout. You can tell. You can tell. I mean, you, you just know he wanted to name it Nuka Cola. Oh, a sewing kit. And that's used. Uh, oh, that's junk. Really? Type junk, material leather, everything you need actually. That's weird that a sewing kit is junk. I wouldn't have thought about, I wouldn't have thought that. Oh, you can use a, a fry cooker. Oh, that's awesome. And I got a bowl. That's beautiful. I'm really surprised that's junk. Oh, well, I could use the leather. So actually that's what I'm here for. <laughs> and I love guys, anyone who's a modder, a, a perspective modder out there, I might want to uh, materials, junk, common, Right, let's just take this all. We'll look through it later. Anyway, um, some of you guys who are metal jug. Okay, maybe I will look through it as we go. Um, I won't take anything apart though. I'll just kind of show you what it is. Anyway, any any modders out there? Any like would be modders out there? Guys, make make the cabinets that we loot worth it. And your mod is like uh, really. That's a good start. That is a really good start. You know what? We should probably get some real tools before we continue breaking into places. Cause this is taking this is taking too long. I will let them break out. What about over here? Anybody over here? That's unlocked, but there's mines in there. I think there's a safe in there that's not that's still locked, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess with the safe. That'll take forever to break into. Man, how have you not broken out yet? What the hell are you doing in here? Come on, dude. All right, so we woke something up over there as well. Ugh. I don't love these high... It's 600 hit points to regular hit points for a door. I don't know. Maybe I'm just... Oh, I'm getting nails, dude. Did you see that? I'm getting nails from the door. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. That makes up for the... I don't really know how many hit points the doors have in vanilla, to be honest. I never really look. So... <laughs> Dead mouse. Oh, yeah. We get organic material. That's good. We're going to need organic material to make... um, uh, To make fertilizer. Okay, good... Cockroach, glass tube. We can, we can start making a meth lab. 
Okay. Oh, oh, Big Bertha. Nice try, Big Bertha. I don't think so. Give me a better spoon. I want more spoon. I want all of your spoons. All right, come on. This uh, this uh, prefab or this yeah, this prefab. This prefab is known to have a lot of zombies in it. Last time I was in this, I had cops like spawning. Oh my god, a fire axe! That is a beautiful thing. That is a beautiful, beautiful thing. Uh, let's let her just break down. I don't care. Boom! How you like me now? Okay, we are not really doing. Oh, is that a gold bar? I'll look at it later. This is not the time. Might be a copper bar. Okay. Zombies seem to be a little bit dumber. I don't know. I don't think that's a mod. I just I think they need to work on the AI. Hello. Hello. God, I got no stamina. Oh, I shot her right in the boob. That was her uh, Achilles boob. <laughs> uh, yeah, copper. Well, this one's gold. Oh, that's brass. Okay. Oh, I like this mod. I like this mod. Uh, chewing gum? Uh, consumable snack. Uh, materials paper. It looks edible. Full. This is one. <laughs> that is good stuff. <laughs> All right. Did we loot everything in here? I think we did. All right, let's get let's get moving. Let's get let's get let's get getting on because I you know I'm freaking gonna die of thirst here as I'm looting a an area I don't need to be looting. Oh, oh, that makes me sad. But at least now I have cures to infection. Painkiller. Wait, painkiller meds. Uh, type medicine materials chemical mixture. Uh, not suggested to be used directly. Oh, look. <laughs> Food poisoning, uh, painkiller, stamina, all kinds of crazy stuff there. Ooh, is that actual water water? No, it's murky water. Damn. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see. No. Okay, let's continue. Err, murgered. Ugh. Stupid door. Why, why are you locked, stupid door? Um, can I make one of these? Uh, let me see. I should probably favorite those. Should I actually you don't need to favorite. There's not a there's not a lot on here. Um, I did put points into that skill, so now we're making fifty instead of uh, twenty fives. All right, let's go ahead and break in this door. Oh, really? Yeah, there we go. Uh, actually, we need be better to do this. Yeah, <laughs> forget doors. Although I probably get something from the doors. I don't think I get nails, but I could possibly. Oh, dude, I'm getting wood. You see that? Okay, I gotta start paying attention. I'm starting to get some really important things while I'm uh, breaking into areas. Wow, there's not even anything in here. Seriously? Okay. It's kind of sucks. Hello. What's up, buddy? Why are you walking in circles? You, you lonely? You're confused. I don't know. Both? Yes, no, maybe so? Come on. Where are you going? Let's, let's hang out. Let's be friends. Okay. Went up there. Let's loot this right here. Oh, what is that? That looked delicious. Um, whiskey. Okay. I'm not a drinker. I don't know. Is whiskey good? I don't know. Some people like to like like whiskey. Ooh, tequila. Is there a worm in the bottle? Okay. Um, negative stamina, negative fullness, uh, plus height. Wow, that's... um. Does it give you some kind, of, some kind of stamina bonus, maybe? Alcohol. Yeah, I probably won't drink that. Is it used for anything? Maybe in a crafting recipe? No. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. All right, let's break down this door. Let's see if we can get some nails from it. Let's see if we get from this door. Let's start paying attention to that. Come on, door. Nothing? Oh, I thought I was going to get stuff from it. Huh. Maybe at this level you start getting stuff from it? No, this doesn't make it give me anything. Do I get stuff from this? I was definitely getting nails. Yeah. Oh, do you have to use the, uh, the weaker item? No, you don't. Okay. I was just, it's just random, I guess. I don't know. I seem to get more stuff from the uh, from the stone hammer. That's interesting. All right, let's go ahead and drink this. Okay. You feel like crushing your enemies. <laughs> yeah, very good, very good. 
Oh, we're actually getting a decent amount of nails, too. That's cool. Nothing up here. Oh, boy. I don't remember this place being this empty last time I was here, but I don't know. Maybe it was. Get me, get some money for me. There we go. All right, food is good. Ooh, another calculator. I'm gonna surround that later. Open this up. Watch out for the mine. Yeah, it's just a, um, it's just a lock safe. I'm not gonna break in that safe. It'll take a freaking year. <laughs> a freaking year. Okay. We need some leather couches, people. I wonder if there's leather couches in that bookstore. Probably books in that bookstore. I should probably really go for leather couches at this point. There we go. Um, ooh, an iron machete. Okay. Okay. Here we go. So the entity damage on this is seven, and on this it's eight. Okay, well, still. Oh, grocery. Oh, there's other couches in that building. I'm pretty sure. Let's go check out that building, see if we can find some other couches. Hey right, guys, I broke in the side here and um, took apart a couple couches. Uh, ooh, a typewriter. Is that multi? No. That's just junk. Materials, iron. We could take it, but I think scrapping it's the only option. Okay, very good, very good. All right, so let's get some more leather, man. We gotta get that forge, like for real. Thing is, I wanna loot so much, you know? It's slowing me down. Trying to get that forge. Um, old sewing machine. All right, that's, that's a multiple material thing. Uh, plates, brass mug. Let me guess what we could do with that brass mug, huh? Pla uh, plastic syringe, toothbrush, sponge, pink handcuffs. Ooh. And those are the handcuffs with the little, you know, things so you don't, so they don't hurt your arms. That's not for, that's not what cops are using. That's all I'm saying. All right, so let's break through here. Ugh. There we go. This is much faster because the uh, the iron axe uses too much stamina, uh, specifically because um, I don't have enough. Like the iron axe uses too much stamina specifically because it's another tier of item to use, right? Um, you guys know how it works. I mean, well, for those of you who don't, uh, when you go up in uh, when you go up in items from the stone to the uh, to the iron, the iron uses a lot more stamina. And as you get your mining tools up and your minor 69er skill, uh, it'll eventually not use as much stamina. So. Um, it'll use less and less. You'll get stamina back faster and faster. Here we go. Now, I don't think I get as much leather back, though, right? So that's only four. But when I use this... That's five. Okay, so there we go. Okay, and we now have enough... Uh, we now have enough for the bellows, I think. Bellows, bellows. Uh, yes, we do. So what else are we missing for the forge? All right, so we need one more iron pipe and then the uh, lump of clay and the small stone. I know we can get an iron pipe. Uh, maybe I should take it apart, right? Instead of bashing it. Let's see if we get anything different from it. All right, so that's iron, 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 and the pipe. Okay. Let me go out and get some clay, guys. And uh, I'm going to get some clay and I'm going to get some stone and then we're going to go ahead and make this forge. Alright guys, let's look through some of this stuff here. Okay, so we got the sander. That is a multiple thingamabob. So we look right there. We accept. We get all those parts. Then we do the same thing with the calculator. Get all the parts. Okay. Uh, I made some hinges because I made extra chests, obviously. Uh, what are we going to do with the pink handcuffs? Trade item. Yes, okay. That makes sense. Uh, we got another multiple here. Let's go ahead and examine that. Get a bunch of stuff. All right, we got food. We've got. You know what? I think I'm gonna mess around with the rest of this stuff uh, during the night because uh, I need. I do need something to do during the night. So I'm gonna go ahead and put all these uh, interesting thingamabobs I just got up there. And eh, whatever, I'll sort it during the night too. I'm wasting daylight here. Ooh, are those shish kebabs? Oh, no. <laughs> I thought I thought it was a shish kebab. I was like, yeah, I'd go for a shish kebab. No, not so much. All right, so let's just put everything up here. We might need this stuff to craft with. We're not going to need that. We're not going to need that. We're not going to need that. Or that. Or that. Or that. Oh, boy. I don't really like to show the um, inventory management here, but this is, uh, this is interesting. This is interesting. All right, so there, there. There. We'll hold on to all those tools. We'll hold on to that. That. Hold on to that. Actually, we don't need this and this. There we go. Okay. 
We'll move that because I want to make a poncho. Um, all right, shut up timer. We're not done yet. All right. Yeah, like I said, I'll deal with all this stuff. Uh, I'll deal with all this stuff uh, in between videos because this is, um, man, this is a this is a big thing right here. Woo. I probably won't show much of it either because it's, I think we've gone over like everything that could be, you know, confusing. Um, I think we've gone over all of it. Uh, the next thing I want to see is I did put down my forge. I wanted me to put down the forge, but check this out, guys. I can't make iron ingots. Well, why can't I make iron ingots? I wonder. I don't know. Blacksmith. Okay. So level two of blacksmith. I need toolsmithing and weaponsmithing too. Crude ingot. That means I can make crude, crude tier tools, right? And then level three, I need mining tools five before I can make iron iron items. Wow. Just wow. Like, what level is that, actually? Um, iron tools, or tools five. Uh, well, I guess it's, a, yeah, player level 30. Can't do iron tools before player level 30, but, but we do have crude, crude tools we could do. Probably next time we level, um, I can get the crude axe and the, and the crude iron shovel. Now, I'm, I'm assuming the crude iron axe uh, does stone as well as wood, just like the other ones do. So, we are going to need some crude ingots. And like I said, crude ingots, yeah, we need to get some more skills. Alright. Oh, look at this jerk. What are you doing, bro? Get out of here, chump. What are you doing, punk? You want to come up here? You want some bad medicine? Alright, get up here. Step up. Step up, then step off. Ooh, sorry about that weird cut, man. That sneeze could not be stopped. Oh, he might be dead. Or maybe he's just laying down. Maybe he's taking a nap. I don't know. Ooh, 206. Might be better than what I got. No, oh, come on. Right, you know what? Screw this. Oh, 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 oh. Come on down here. I'm over here, buddy. Man, you, you've been begging for it. You really have. Oh, okay. Oh my god, I didn't even see you. Oh, there's more stuff in this building to loot. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's loot this building and then call it a video. And then we'll go over what we can do with, oh my goodness. Oh, a yo-yo. Oh, I love yo-yos. Oh my god, get up, Big Bertha. Come on, Big Berthas. I need me some spoons. Let's go. There we go. Oh, by the by the way, the reason I don't have a lot of uh, skill points is because I put points oh into minor sixty nine er um, in between cuts. Knock him down, knock him out. Okay, all right, that's not bad. What do you got? Um, oh, oh, got a steel shovel. Hell's yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We should loot this as well. Sponge. All right. All right, oh my goodness. Were you the one who was making all the noise all night? Freaking punk. I gotta find a place to live too. I really don't wanna live on the top of this building. Gotta start thinking about Horde Night as well. Oh wow, very good. Oh, there's leather, there's leather right there. And I didn't loot any of this. Oh, there we go, we got a cooking pot. I'll make the water uh, during the night. Oh, very good. Very good. I don't have any dukes. Come on. Try to hit escape like a bunch of times. It wasn't working. Okay, so I did loot. Oh, I didn't loot this one. What is that? Coffee. Okay. I'd like me some coffee. Uh, toothbrush, old shampoo. Man, they, they give out a pretty decent amount of these uh, herbal antibiotics. Blanket. Ooh, a banky. A juicer. Uh, small bin. Uh, yeah, like I said, I love these mods that make me loot everything. Nuts and bolts, bottle cap, rotten apple core. Um, paint can. Oh, so all the paint cans are different colors now, huh? Alright. Yeah, dealing with the inventory is quite, uh, you know, quite interesting in this game. Uh, it's it's tough for me because I, I don't want to show a lot of the inventory management. Like, that's my gut instinct. Don't show inventory management. But at the same time, it's it's kind of a big deal with this game. With this mod. Come on. Oh, boy. Time for you to go bye-bye. 
Wow, your neck has seen better days. Oh, we got a special book. Another one, guys. As good as new. 5% increased melee weapon repair amount. That's interesting. All right. Very good. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, by the way, these cockroaches can be turned into um, uh, organic, but you need like a handful of them. I'm not sure how many a handful is, but more than I have. Um, a rusty kettle, headphones, old speaker box. Wow. The loo is really fun. Oh, a taco. It's taco night, guys. Okay. Cutlery and some steel arrows. Uh, what is that? Is that something I need? I'll bet you that's something I need. Yep. Engineering table. All right. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. I'm put that right on my hot bar. Uh, brass key. Is that for anything? Ah, uh, it's just junk. I was hoping it would open something. Um, what does this take? Okay, so it takes the, uh... Actually, what is that ammo called? That's not 44 Magnum ammo, is it? Uh, 357 Oh, wow, okay. Alright. I'm down. A woman's wallet. Okay. Pre that's pretty, um... It's, it's pretty precise. Did we loot everything in here last time? I think we did. Let's loot the back room now. Call it a video. Yeah, I need to find out. I need to find a place to live. Like a real place to live. I don't know if I want to live here. I'm going to live in this town until I find a mini bike. But once I get a mini bike, I'd like to move somewhere else. So I got, I got to think about where I want to live. And I got to start thinking about um, a horde base. Probably just make my normal horde base. Just because um, I'm, I'm really excited for this uh, mod. And when I'm really excited, I get distracted. I don't know if I'm gonna have, I don't know if I'm gonna have the, the mental agility to think of an interesting horde base uh, with this mod because this mod's so freaking interesting in itself, right? All right, scavenging is going up. That's quite nice. Open this up. Nothing. Eh, I'm not gonna take some pills just yet because I could get hit points back by eating, so. Oh, wow. Yep, okay. Uh, maybe I should repair this. Oh, I can't repair it. Because I need to find the book or spend the perk. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm going to stop using this then. Let's um, let's use this 206. I can repair this, right? Yeah. Let's, um, let's actually repair this and then use it. Okay. What you got for me? Oh. Elite pistol schematic. I like. I like. All right, there is a safe on the other side of this door. I think I'm gonna break it. I think I'm gonna break in that safe. I wouldn't normally do it this early in the game, but I, I kind of want to see what what the safe has to offer in this mod. So uh, let me break in the safe, guys. I'll come back once I'm in there. Wow, guys, this is taking a lot freaking longer than I wanted it to. This was 110% not worth the effort. But once I got started, I was like, you know what? I'm dedicated. Let's just do it. I didn't want to let my I didn't want to let my viewers down. Um, they want to know what's in this safe, and I'm gonna show it to them. Damn it! <laughs> so let's get this done and call this long ass video a video. Come on, man. Let's do this. Open sesame. Okay. Wow. Wow. Definitely not worth it. Uh, let's loot this. Uh, chair wheel, that's resources uncommon. Uh, chair wheel, resources. Oh, those are used for something. All right, let's 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 take a look at these really quick. Recipes, yeah, so we could use to make a chair. I, I don't care about making chairs. What will we use this for? To make a shopping cart. Hmm. Shopping cart might be cool to get stuff around. I wonder if I can actually use it as a shopping cart. I don't think about that. And gold pocket watch. Ooh, very rare trade item. That's just something to sell, right? Gold trade item. Um, complaining. Some traders might be interested in buying this. Okay, cool. All right, guys. I am going to call this one here. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.